We're about to interview one super good looking guy and one funny one. They're coming out with a brand new movie called Bounce Back. The gentlemen are with us right now. And Bill, did you have to go out and pick a movie with a GQ supermodel in it? Yeah, <laughs> man. We just putting pressure on the game. <laughs> <laughs> well, Bill. Hey, uh, man. Go ahead. <laughs> no, no. So I'm just curious, Bill. I got to imagine with you being in this film, all your friends are asking you the same question. Is he single? Yeah, yeah, he's single. You know, I'm, I'm the one locked up. I'm good. This dude is, is fun, crazy. He's an executive producer of The Bounce Back. And on top of that, he get naked in every scene. <laughs> <laughs> No, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. But we have so much fun making this movie, man. Honestly, bro, I can't even. It, it, it is not even work, bro. We just, we really just nailed it down. We got an opportunity, two friends to work together and actually make a great movie. We, you know, when we're off camera, we just be laughing like, dang, man, we really, you know, we're really doing it. We're you not know? work. We're really not working. Yeah. I mean, it, it doesn't feel like work. I mean, yeah. we, we've been doing our thing. We met back doing the brothers, you know, back in the day, 15 years ago, yeah. and had chemistry ever since. I'm just a fan. That's when I had abs. <laughs> <laughs> I, I got to. So, Bill, I, so, go ahead. I just wanted to ask. I mean, you mentioned he was executive producer. So, while you were acting alongside him, did he ever pull out his boss card on you? Oh, man. It, it's, you know, that's a really great title. Um, it's a great thing. But when you have a guy like Shamar, I mean, it's basically like he's the point guard of this project, you know, and, you know, he has a vision and he wanted, he was very passionate about what he wanted to do. And I, I, I thought it was worthy of being a part of because I feel the same. You know, when you when you work with your friends and you got support, that's all you really want in this game. And it's hard to to come by. So, you know, when you when we're sitting here talking to everybody, we we, we are genuine. We are genuine. I'm, I'm a rookie. I'm Shamar, a rookie. So, Go ahead. I'm Go ahead. sorry. I'm just curious. What got you excited about this project even before Bill was on board? You know, it just. It was just a fun, I've, I've been so blessed over 24 years to do my thing as an actor in front of the camera. And then, and I knew I was going to transition, you know, uh, off of Criminal Minds. Yeah, I started in the soap world and then I got to the primetime thing. And I just, I want to keep flying and just see how high I can fly. Yeah. And, uh, and so part of that transition was, you know, of course I want to keep acting. And, but, you know, if you sit back and wait for Hollywood and, and for the phone to ring, you know, hopefully that happens. And, but also there, there might be ideas out there that Hollywood's not thinking about that, that you think you're capable of. And so the bounce back is is really just the first it's just the beginning of the the, the next chapter of what i want to do in my career because i still want to throw it out in front of the camera but yeah. produce it this is just a fun little movie it's just a good little story it's just a good time and it was you know just a nice little different color of what people have been seeing me do for the last decade and i was kicking down doors and being a badass so this is just kind of a lighter side just a fun side about love about relationships about friendships but as far as me executive producing I'm a rookie to it, so I had to kind of figure out what being the boss meant. So it wasn't like, I mean, if I was cracking a whip, you was it was a good boss. It was, I was, it was, a, I was a good boss. <laughs> it, was I was, a good boss. it was a soft whip, but, <laughs> but you know, when you got professionals, and, and and I'm just, a, I'm a fan of Bill. I'm a fan of Nadine Velasquez, and so many folks that have established career. Uh, uh, Michael Beach, Cheryl Underwood, uh, Vanessa Bell, Boutet. Uh, Denise Boutet, Vanessa Bell Calloway. So we, really my producing came in the conversation of getting them hyped up. And once they understood the story and once they understood the vision of what I wanted, and because it was about what we wanted, I'm not going to tell this man how to do him. <laughs> I'm not going to tell him how to do his funny. I just, I said, I just, but I sat back. So it was interesting as I was acting opposite Bill and Nadine, I was saying my words as an actor, but my producer had, I was actually not telling them what to do, was rooting for them to do what I know they can do, what they're trying to do, because they can do it the best. This guy is <laughs> hilarious and he's so good. And Nadine is so stunningly beautiful, but so talented and very funny as well. And it was just, it was fun to see the, the story come to life and yeah. watch them fly. Yeah, I think everybody's going to really enjoy this film, man. It's it's like the the little the little tugboat that uh, just really pushing strong. Uh, it opens December 9th. Go to the theaters. Fellas, it's a great date night. Mm -hmm. All the ladies, you want to get some martinis and go out with some popcorn. Mm -hmm. Come see your boy Shamar and Bill Bellamy, the bounce back boy. You're going you to laugh. He's going to make you tickle <laughs> your pants, and then you're going to go home and you have a good night. I promise. I'm promise! Gonna...
feel good. Happy holidays. <laughs> well, we certainly love feeling good around the holidays, and I certainly, uh, you guys made me laugh today. Can't wait to see that chemistry come alive in the new movie, Bounce Back. And thank you also for what you're doing uh, for your co-star. That's really amazing. Uh, happy holidays, guys. Thank you, brother. Thank you, buddy.